The number of older people in New Zealand and around the world is growing really rapidly and that's going to be an increasing problem for the healthcare and care system because there aren't enough staff or won't be enough staff to look after the growing number of older people. Here at the University of Auckland we're working with a Korean research lab, ETRI, and a Korean robot company, Yuzhen Robot, to create mobile service robots that will help look after older people. Our robot system is designed to monitor people's location for people who wander, to remind people to take their medication, to detect falls and bring help when they need it, and to monitor people's vital signs and report it to the healthcare system. People can interact with, it, with anything on the internet using our robot because it's connected to the internet. So the benefits are that this enables people to be more connected, it can collect data from people and it can provide information to people and link them up to their families, their caregivers and their friends when maybe they're not as mobile as they might have been. It's really hard to bring a robot from a lab setting into real users' home and have them interact and serve the people. That's why we are doing so much testing in the Southern Village to find out the most acceptable design for the robot. At the University of Auckland, we have different research groups. For example, speech, robotics, health IT, health psychology. So my role in the project is to understand the work done by different research groups and to integrate them in order to make the final robotic application. Older people have a lot of experience and wisdom and they deserve to have the best of care. Um, as the number of older people grows, it'll be a challenge to look after them and our robot system will really help care for older people and improve their quality of life.